how to create different character facial expressions in Leonardo AI. We'll go step by step and show how we can tweak our prompt and settings to generate facial expressions like happy, angry, surprised, and more. We are going to select a model and configure settings, add a prompt and negative prompt, enable and configure image guidance features, and test and apply what you've learned. If you're not yet familiar or want a refresher on the essentials such as prompt structures and creating consistent characters in Leonardo AI, click on the link above. Before moving further, here's a tip that can save you hours of your time and frustration in creating different facial expressions with consistent characters. It may be counterintuitive, but for now, in these examples we're going to go through together, do not use the image guidance feature character reference. Yes, we may like to maintain consistent characters in our image generation, but these same features also hinder the variation of the character's facial expression. The challenge is maintaining the right balance or figuring out the right balance of preserving the character and at the same time varying the facial expression. Instead, use either seat ID or image guidance feature image to image for consistent character persistence. In these examples, we'll be using the model Albedo Base XL and later Absolute Reality version 1.6 set to dynamic. Also, we enable negative prompt. For input dimensions, we match it with the dimensions of the model, 1024 by 768. For image guidance in this example, select a reference image, set style reference, maximum strength, and image to image 0 0.5. Let's try to create a happy facial expression. For the prompt, we have happy, broad smile, showing teeth with upturned corners of the mouth, raised cheeks, brown eyes. For the negative prompt, we have deformed features, deformed face, deformed hands, extra fingers, extra toes, and so on. Click generate to create the image. And in our first attempt, we're able to create an image that is at the very least smiling and consistent with the happy facial expression. Let's try to vary the image to image strength from 0.5 to 0.4. Click generate and see what happens. As we can see, reducing the strength of the image to image feature led to a bigger smile in the facial expression. Now let's see what happens if we change the model to absolute reality. Click generate. And as we can see, we have a more realistic skin tone, less of a tune-like uh, image, but at the same time, a happy facial expression. Let's try another example for a surprised facial expression. Take note of the changes in the prompt and the settings, especially the image to image strength, which is 0.28. In this output, it's more of a minor startle rather than an extreme surprise. Let's change the model to absolute reality and maintain image to image and change the strength from 0.8 to 0.45. We click generate and see what happens. In this case, we get a more worried surprise look in the outward image. Let's try out negative facial expressions. And in this case, we're trying to generate an angry facial expression with Albedo Base XL. And we're having somewhat of an acutely angry facial expression. Now let's try to change the image to image strength from 0.8 to 0.20. And we get an angrier facial expression to some extent if you look at the eyebrows. Now let's change it, the image to image strength from 0.20 to 0.15 and the angry facial expression is more pronounced. Now let's change the model to absolute reality. Okay, we click generate. And we see the output image. It's more exaggerated crumpled eyebrows, crumpled skin on the eyebrows, which is somewhat of an unrealistic angry expression. But that's what we get from uh, Absolute Reality Model. 
So let's just change the image strength higher to 0.55 and click generate again. Okay, less pronounced, crumpled skin on the eyebrows, and definitely an angry expression. Let's try another negative facial expression, afraid, looking extremely fearful. And okay, we set our settings and strength. In this case, image, we put it down to 0.20. Yep, 0.20 and we click generate and see what happens okay this was the albedo excel model and uh, it's somewhat of a startled partially fearful facial expression let's lower the strength a bit again to 0.15 let's try to see what happens Okay, it's a little bit of a more startled, partially afraid facial expression in this case. Let's change the model to absolute reality. Okay, click generate. And now it's a more pronounced fearful look in this particular model for absolute reality versus Albedo XL. Okay, let's try another one. Okay, partially afraid. No, more afraid in this case and more crumpled look at the eyebrows. What have you learned? So we were able to generate different facial expressions using some of the models in the NRD AI. And in this case, it was Albedo XL and Absolute Reality version 1.6. So when we were creating facial expressions from happy, surprised, afraid, uh, angry, we tried to tweak the settings in order to get the facial expression that we want. For the prompt, it is best to try to have as few words as possible to get the generated facial expression that we'd like. If you'd like more content like this, don't forget to like and subscribe to get more. Also, if you want to try to check out the essentials in terms of prompt structures and Leonardo AI consistent characters, uh, check out the, these video links above.